Um, basically I got bought a camera for Christmas because I wanted one so I could take it on holidays and vlog more but I also thought I could vlog more now. So basically I'm going to do my first week back at uni today, it is the 11th of January um, but it's 11.30 now and today I have just woken up, I was on FaceTime to my friend Jen who lives in Australia so I was on FaceTime to her for quite a long time this morning and then um, I had some breakfast, had a sesame seed bagel, it was lovely um, and now I'm just going to do a workout, hence the workout gear for my workout I'm just wearing a little bow and tee flowery top and the matching short so I'll link them below um, but I get a medium if that helps anyone if they want it but it's really comfy and I love it and yeah I'm wearing shorts in winter because I get really hot but yeah so I have just well not just it's now um 20 to 1 so I did my workout just a short one today and then I had a shower and I've just straightened my hair um and now I'm just going to go we use canvas at university it's like this thing that all your modules are on so I'm just going to go on there and see if any of my pre-recorded lectures are out um, do those and then also I'll just get on with sort of going through the modules trying to figure out what my assignments are and just overall just getting a general gist of what I have to do this semester um, usually the first week is kind of just like introducing you to the modules so this week shouldn't be too taxing if there's any reading I'm just going to make sure I can get that um, also if there's any books that I need from the library for this semester which I can check out and I think you can do click and collect still with our library I'm really hoping you can um, if not I'll just read them online um, but yeah this is what I put on my outfit oh and I know that Louis's lecture finishes at three so we're probably going to go on a walk at three so I thought I should probably get dressed as well and as you can see straighten my hair because my hair was a bit gross, it's not going to lie, that's why I had a shower. Um, but I've just got on this like Goose and Gander t-shirt, which is like, got, it's got a little dinosaur in it, it's baby blue. And yeah, it's really cute. And then, got some glow joggers, because joggers are life. Right, so we're back in my room, I've got my bottle of water, and then I actually made myself a hot chocolate that's literally the size of my head. But I love, like, cream I have a real like guilty pleasure for like cream and marshmallows and hot chocolate and then I just grabbed myself a snack they're like what's this but they're like the fake ones from um Aldi but they're really nice actually um and then yeah I'm gonna get on with some uni work so yeah but I've got my hot chocolate for company now so I think I'm living the best life hello so you finished your lecture what yeah, I need to get the hang of how to like angle this camera because I haven't quite mastered that yet um, but we are just walking to town um, because he wants a calendar and we might as well go on a walk um, why is it so hard to ask that thing? and I'm used to holding my phone to vlog, not a camera and yeah I haven't been very productive I did one lecture um, but I still I'm got that I yeah I know but I've still got some online to finish um, and then yeah, I also ordered him a present. And then, yeah, we're just going to walk to town. As I said, we went to town. Um, basically, one of my friends has tested positive for COVID and she lives alone. So I wanted to get her some bits and just drop it outside her house. Obviously, I won't see her, um, but just drop it there and then let her know it's outside. Just because I wouldn't want to be quarantined alone, not being able to leave the house at all. So hopefully, she feels better for herself. But yeah, so I got her some bits. So um, she's really into fitness. So I got her some muscle soak. It's like bubble bath. My mum has it, and I you do use it sometimes for my mum, and it's really good. So <laughs> I got her that, and then I got her a couple of protein bars. I hope she likes these flavors. The one I don't know anything about this, so I think I've seen her eat these before, and I've also seen Saffron Bark eat them, and she has a lot of protein bars. So the one's cookie dough, one's caramel kale. So they sound good. So um, and then they had these on sale in. Super drug, didn't they? Yeah. Um, these are really, really expensive, so I was like, cool, get these. Um, it's like a little Aurora bath slithering. It was all rest And then that'll be creepy. It probably will be creepy, but it's quite awesome. Mm. I got her some strawberries, um, because she is into fitness and stuff, so she just eats healthily, I know. Yes. And some strawberry yogurt. I mean I wish I had the motivation to eat my saffron, but um and then I also got her a little recharge smoothie and 
some little tulip, are these tulips? Yeah, yeah some little is. lilac tulips and a little card as well. And I'm going to make her some cupcakes and put that in there as well. I've also got some shoes that she wanted me to buy with my discount. So I need to get back to her as well. So I'll just pretend that I'm just dropping that off and put all this in like a little box. Do we have any Amazon boxes? I love mine. Okay, cool. That's fine. So yeah, we'll use that. And then, and then you're going to make those. Uh, oh, yeah, I've got some mini eggs. eggs. I thought I'd do that mini egg cupcake for people. So everyone deserves a treat. So, what did you get? Hmm? What did I get? What food was it? Anything. Well, I got this. This is Doctor Who calendar. <laughs> I'm a nerd. No, you like your Doctor Who calendar, so. I do. It keeps me organised as well. So. I love that organisation. So, to finish off this evening, I'm just going to make my cupcakes. I'm going to make mini egg ones and I also have some of these which I've never seen before. They're like mini egg chocolate eggs. So I'm going to do like just normal vanilla cupcakes with some crushed up mini eggs in. Some are going to have chocolate icing with the um, chocolate orange eggs and some will have vanilla and pink icing for the mini egg ones. So I'm very excited to make these. I'll show you what I've got and the ingredients. The recipe is Jane's Patisserie. Um, so I'll link that below if you want to do one too because all her recipes are really good. I've used quite a few before. But yeah, I'll show you what I've got. And I also got these new oh, don't know happened to the lighting there. Um these pink and blue and funky colours um cupcake cases. So that's very exciting. Yeah, so these are just my cupcake cases. My oven is preheated to 180. That's just heating up for me now. And then what you need is you need three eggs, some butter. So we've got the mini eggs, I've got my caster sugar in my sugar pot. Um, I can not get red food colouring, but I think, like, when, if I don't use too much, it should be okay. I've got my celery raisin flour, um, some vanilla extract, and then icing sugar for the, um, for the buttercream. Um, and I have got cocoa powder in the cupboard and then just my weighing scale. And there's a really cute duckie blue bowl. The cupcakes are done. We've got some chocolate orange ones. And then this is like pink icing with normal and these are mini egg ones. I'm going to have a chocolate one. Louise demolished his. <laughs> um, this one won't fit in the tub, but I'm sure we'll eat it tomorrow. I'll just leave it on top. And then I've just packaged three up for Sarah. Hello, welcome to Tuesday. Um, so I'm just, well, I, well, it's quite late now. I think it's like 12.30. Um, I've had a bit of a traumatic morning. It's all right though. Um, I woke up, just gave the house a bit of a clean, and um, then I had a seminar at 11.30 to 12.30, um, which was cool, it was for, the module was called Neo Classicism, it was actually the module that um, I didn't pick, because one of my modules didn't have enough people on it, so they put me on that one, which is fine, um, but it sounds quite interesting, so and the lecture seems really lovely, um, so yeah. But we have, we've had issues with things being in our loft, but nothing went in the traps. But this morning there was loads of noise coming from the loft. So we think something might have got caught, which was horrible. But So I've emailed and someone's coming tomorrow, so I'll find out tomorrow. But yeah, that's why it's been a little bit traumatic. Um, but yeah, so now I'm just walking down to Saf's to drop her little pass off. That's it for now, and then I'll come back. And I've got another lecture at two. So not too bad today. I need to get on with some pre-recorded content. So I have dance 6.45. What is the time now? But I think it's like 6.30. Um, I've got a tap class. Then I have a fitness class till 8.30. Then I have a 45 minute break, so I'll make us dinner. And then I have a jazz class. So yeah, so I need some energy. I think I need some water as well. Thank you. Maybe you just made me some toast. Yes, I'll link all my outfits in this vlog down below, not that anyone probably cares. But, um, it's really nice, it's black and it looks high. You can like tie it multiple ways. Then these are gym shark leggings. Um, I don't, that's what I like to say. <laughs> and then underneath I just have this bone tea sports bra, I wore it the other day. And then I'll just need my tap shoes for tonight. Um, and because I'm in the house, I wear socks over them so I don't mark the floor. Lord knows that I've tried to You said I was the only one No one likes being like to You made this mess and left me with the pieces 
So this is our meal. It, I mean, it's pretty damn big. We've got the seat corner, put some butter in there. Louis doesn't like butter, so I've just put it in mine. And then these are our burgers. We've got bacon, got cheese in there, burger. I'm gonna add some ketchup to mine and that's Louis. Hello, um, this is post dance now. Um, I'm just ready for bed. Actually wearing my little dance t-shirt. It says my name on the back and it just says like our dance society and everything. Which, oh yeah, I probably didn't mention the reason I had dance tonight is I don't do dance at university, I do a society, um, I do the dance society at university basically, um, and I'm actually social tech, so, you know, that's great, um, I actually love it, it's so much fun. So tonight in tap we just did some technique, and then I had fitness, which is just like an hour fitness class, I had jazz, which was, um, we learnt a dance, which was really fun, but this is Tuesday over. So tomorrow I have one lecture, but for now, peace out, it's bedtime. Hi, welcome to Wednesday. It is 12.30am. I feel like I always start these vlogs quite late, so I'm sorry about that. Um, but I had a lecture about my dissertation today. It wasn't very helpful because it was like with all the history people. Wow, what is my hair? Um, it was with all the history people. So it's just talking about history, not classics, which was great. Then I had a meeting with my social tech for my society and we planned our social for the semester. Um, we're trying to do some more creative online ones, but now I'm just going to crack on with some uni work because I've been so lazy. Um, also, the, pers the maintenance man came today and he went in the loft and there was nothing up there, but the traps have gone down and the bait has gone. So something's clearly been up there. So he's going to just patch up the holes in the next couple of days and hopefully our loft will be sorted, which is great. I haven't really um, vlogged much, so sorry. Um, but just kind of done nothing today. <laughs> but I've been making dinner. This is risotto. Um, I just used some stock and a stock cube and then put some garlic granules in there. Um, it's just risotto rice, peas, some onions that I fried off with the sausages, cut the sausages up and then I'm just leaving it to smell. But yeah. And I'm just going to chill out again tonight. Sorry, today hasn't been very interesting. Hey, um, so I think I'm going to wipe in the background, just making myself a hot chocolate. Um, it's about 12 o'clock now. Um, it's Thursday. Um, I've just got this little soap jobbers, um, like a cropped jumper on it from Shein. Um, yeah, and then I'm just going to get on my uni rest again today. We don't have any scheduled classes. But I have quite a lot of pre-recorded stuff to get on with and then I'm sure me and Lou will go on a walk and I've got dance 6 till 10 tonight so... Oh no, I don't think I have it till 10 because basically they don't always... We're not always in till 10 every Thursday, it's like every other Thursday so that's the plan for today, nothing that exciting um, but yeah, it's just, well, it's just uni from home isn't it, it's never that exciting oh, I keep balancing on like the weirdest things um, so I was just doing one of my online lectures. The package came. Um, I'm pretty sure it's from Too Faced. So I thought I'd open it. Oh, even have like a full tab. It took us quite a while to get. It took quite a while to ship. Um, I think it's because like obviously with the lockdown. Um, I think Royal Mail and stuff is with Royal Mail, and I think they're having quite a lot of issues. Oh. Why can't I open it? It's so cute. Yeah, I ordered a few bits. Um, they had a lot of stuff on sale. Oh, it's like attached. I like this. That's so weird. It's like attached. I can kind of see what I got. But I haven't... I used to buy makeup all the time. And I just haven't, like, bought any in a while. So I thought, for myself, you know. Um, and I wanted this, like, gingerbread. Basically, I got the pumpkin spice melted matte lipstick and it smells like pumpkin spice and like look at it look at the packaging can you see it and i love Too Faced makeup and i have quite a lot of their products and it give it a little cheeky pop i like colors like this as well to like put on and then like put a, like a nude in the middle to make it like the ombre thingy but yeah actually it's hannah's fault that i looked on Too Faced because she bought me a lip gloss from them for Christmas and it made me realise how much I missed buying makeup 
Then we have this as well, which is a Too Faced gingerbread spice palette. The packaging is just so cute. Like Too Faced do packaging so well. And yeah, I look, it's like a, it's like the little. And I love. I have the Sweet Peach palette, and I love it. And like, look at those shades. Ooh, like the the pinky purples. I thought were so pretty. And oh, it smells like oh, it smells like gingerbread. I just think it's so cute. And um, this one wasn't on sale, but they had street discount, so I kind of just got it anyway. And this smells like berry jam, and it's another one of their mini palettes. Because I feel like in the mini palettes, you actually kind of get the better colours. Like, um, I don't know, the bigger palette versions of these I didn't really like. Um, I just think these, like the pretty, pretty shimmers, are so pretty. And like, oh, they're so nice. Oh, <laughs> so I'm going to trust with that. Yeah, that is my little my little mini haul that I'm gonna carry on with uni. So, um it's now five o'clock basically, it's ten past five. Um I just got ready for dance. Did my hair in a little bun because first seat back goes ballet, but I'm like well making effort. Um I had dance at six, so I have like some time, I'm just gonna tidy up my room a bit. Um I finished another lecture and some reading, so I've done quite a lot of work today. But yeah, um, I've just got my little Adidas shorts on. I'm not this pale. I have my ballet tights on. And then I think this leave has one block. It's really cute. It's got my belt on the back. But yeah, and I've just put my hair in a little bun. It's not the neatest bun, but it's a bun, so we'll work with it. Um, I just look all different today. I don't know, I just woke up this morning and felt like I wanted to get ready. I think it was because I got those new eyeshadow palettes yesterday. So I wanted to test them out and I did this with it. It's like pinky and purpley. Um, I used both the ginger... There's, I think I only used one shade out of the gingerbread one, but this is mainly the jam palette. Um, the That's My Jam palette. But yeah, it's actually now like 1.30 and I haven't really done much apart from get ready and straighten my hair and watch some YouTube but I've got a lecture at three and I'm gonna do the pre-recorded one now before the lecture starts. And yeah, that's basically the plan for today. Um, and then we're having fajitas for dinner later. Um, I'll probably do some work after my lecture as well. And yeah, that's kind of all for today. And then we need to also later plan some questions because me and Louie are doing a quiz with my mum and dad tomorrow, which I'm quite excited about. Um, but yeah, so otherwise, not really done much also keep my little Louis not Louis oh my god keep my little um Liam uh it's like a mini do you remember when everyone used to have them like the what are they called what are they called like the you know what they are but yeah I've got my mini one in the background so I should get a message any second now telling me it's recording yeah okay good I don't know why, because I was going to get you in it, but apparently you don't want to be in the vlog. When did it be it? I don't know, probably not. Oh, okay. We just watched, what was it called, Stage? Yeah. It was with David Tennant and Mike and Sheen. It's very good, I would recommend it. Each episode's like 15 minutes, so we just watched the whole of season yeah. one. Yeah. And then, as I said earlier, we're having a family quiz night tomorrow with my mum and dad, so we're just going to prep our questions now. Um, yeah, and we've also got, I'm still getting confused with this whole opposite angles thingy, um, Jane the Virgin on, in the background, and yeah, um, when we didn't do the dishes tonight, I put the dishwasher on. Yeah, yeah. I know. What a shock. Was that the third time? I know, no, only second. Yeah. If anyone doesn't know, and he's really particular about the washing up, so he doesn't let me do it. So he does the dishwasher. Because now I've just discovered you put the dishwasher on an eco, so of course it's not going to wash. Yeah, it. I didn't realise the thing was on eco, so we've just put it on intensive. So hopefully um, it works. But I mean, we've literally what, lived here for nearly how long now? Like three, four months. Four months. Four months, and we don't even know what? how to use the dishwasher. So that's great. So we have completed the list. Um, this is our list of questions so we have all these questions you can pause it if you really want to read them but i was told no harry potter questions so we've had to try and go with things that aren't that but yeah and we thought we'd finish with this one 
what rodents have we in our loft because it's quite funny. Now we're going to go to bed once the dishwasher's finished. Mm -hmm. Hi, I don't actually think I took my makeup off properly last night. Um, it is about midday. Apparently I don't vlog till midday, it's becoming a theme. Um, I'm in the kitchen, I'm going to do some uni work. Maybe like an hour of it, I bring a CBA. And yeah, um, I had some breakfast, FaceTime Jen. Um, we've also been here, we got woken up this morning at like 8.30 from the squirrel. Um, we think there's one trapped in our loft. Because obviously they've meshed, I told you that yesterday they meshed up the holes. But I think they've now trapped one in, which is great. It sounds like it's trying to either, it's either on top of the roof and it's trying to get in. Or it's um, stuck in the roof and trying to get out. So we told them again, so hopefully then someone will come and fix it finally. But today I'm wearing this little goose and gander jumper. It's like in a nudie, a nudie colour with the pastel writing. And the picture of this that I wore yesterday. Hey! Um, so it is now 241 and me and Louis have both finished our uni work for the day so we're going to play on Mario Kart Hello Hello Why are you not? You're like running away Yeah we're going to play Mario Kart and we all know that I'm better at Mario Kart than him So... Don't because you beat me up No I don't, shut up So yeah we'll let you know who wins but it's going to be me And take your bets, who do you think won Mario Kart? That's right, I did. Um, I did. So there's that. I mean, we do get quite competitive when we play Mario Kart. My thumb is dead. Um, we were playing it for quite a long time. It's now like five past four. Um, when did we start? I don't know. Like three. Mm. But he's a very sore loser. I'm gonna go watch episode Dance Moms and get some. I mean, you didn't win. I literally did, like shut up. Oh, you didn't miss, uh, yeah. yeah, we were going to do 32 rounds, but neither is how late it was. Um, we just did 17, but I won out of the 17 rounds, so that counts, doesn't it? Hey, so I'm just finishing, getting ready, I'm just doing my hair. I need to make an outfit. Um, it's just coming up to 5.15. Um, I used the That's My Jam palette again. In kind of the same way I did yesterday, but I actually kind of really like it. And then again, I used the Too Faced Melted Matte Lipstick. I really hate most lipstick. I know, it's a throwback to these. And an even bigger throwback, I used the Tanya Burr lip gloss in Chic. Um, I just really like this lip gloss, I'm not going to lie. I need to find a way to get a new one. Um, but obviously, kind of discontinued now. So I don't know if anyone's interested, but the foundation I used was the Fenty one. I just used the Fenty, like, I think it's called like the body glow thing just underneath and um, the lashes I'm wearing are they're quite dramatic but they are doll lashes they're kind of like the pink box and you can get one pretty little thing and you can be able to get one in top shop as well but I know a lot of top shops are top shops are closing these are the most like name brook these are really good they're my go-to lashes I used um the Urban Decay bronzer um in bronze my bronzer, the Mary Luminizer for my highlighter, and the Benefit Curly Stir for my blusher. I think I'm going to use the That's My Jam palette and the Gingerbread palette for my eyeshadow. And oh, and I used the Rimmel Brow Gel on my eyebrows. Yeah, I just used Brow Gel on my eyebrows to try and make them look a bit more natural. Um, yeah, I think that's everything used. Oh, and obviously just just use the Rimmel loose powder. Um, but yeah, I don't think. Oh, and I, I also basically if you can do it, I really like using. This is the Maddy Ziggler Morphe palette. It's like this shade just under my eyes to like brighten them. Um, so I use that as well, and I use that on my eyebrows. But yeah, that's everything I used on my face. So I've just got dressed and I've just finished my hair. I just popped in these little clips. They've got like a light pink and a dark pink. And then like a, oh you can't even see. Like a blue and like a pink. 
Um, actually, the one is when I was uh, moving back to uni in my room. I think like, they were like my kitty clips, and I just thought they were really cute. You know, my hair at the back is a bit chaotic. Um, and then this little cardigan is from Rebellious Fashion. I got it about two years ago now, though. Um, I will try and link it if I can. And then these jeans are from In The Style. They're like wide leg, and they're just a bit like loose. So they're just nice and comfy. Like I look like I've got an outfit on, but also can fit in them. Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. We're playing um, Pictionary on your head, basically. <laughs> but who won the quiz? We did. <laughs> Doesn't matter, we're still the winners. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Do you want to wave goodbye to the vlog? So I have just finished cleaning, mopped the kitchen, wiped the sides, cleaned some of the inside of the cupboards, um, just got the bits we don't need. Hi Louis. And I've hoovered and cleaned the bath. So it's a nice fresh start to the week. So, what did I make, Louis? Roast dinner. Look at my roast dinner. I made Yorkshire puddings, I made my own pigs and blankets, my roast potatoes and sweet roast potatoes went so well. Got stuffing, peas, I seasoned the chicken, a gravy, and I added the chicken, um, like the things, you know, when you get the juices into the gravy. I'm so excited. Why? Why did they do so? I'm like. <laughs> We'll figure it out. There we go. Now we're just going to watch to all the boys on the floor because the third one comes out in February and Louis hasn't seen any of them. Mm. So he needs to watch the first two before we can watch the third one. Um, and yeah, and this is going to be the end of this vlog. Welcome to a week in the life of a uni student from home. Um, please subscribe and like and comment. It'll be great. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye.